Hi everyone and welcome back to the channel. So today I'm playing a Dragon Paladin deck and I've tried to combine it with a Quest Paladin deck as well. And the reason I wanted to go with Dragons because I was discussing it with Eric in the comments and he mentioned the Cathedral Gargoyle which is a really, really strong card for two mana, um, get 2-2 two, two with Divine Shield and Torn. It is probably one of the better two drops in the game, uh, obviously if we ignore Keliseth. Um, so it has this really powerful effect but the problem is you do have to have a dragon in your hand and dragons are kind of difficult to make work in Paladin but we've had a few new dragons in the new expansion so it's definitely worth trying. And also a really good card introduced is Fire Tree Witch Doctor which if you do have a dragon in your hand is quite a powerful card to play on too. So we've got some pretty good two drops um, and also we can play Swamp Dragon Egg so I thought perhaps putting the quest in there here as well could help because you can play these pretty good um, one and two drops and then buff them and of course I've got the banana buffoon, the banana dude, he helps to buff and complete your quest as well. But to be honest guys, after playing and experimenting with this game, it's probably a little bit less than average. Um, the dragon synergies probably aren't strong enough really to make the deck worthwhile. And we know the last Kaleidosaur is a pretty cool quest, but over the time that it's been in the game, it hasn't ever really been really powerful and I, I don't think this changes things. The dragons um, give you some kind of good mid-range abilities and the way that you win is just get to play these cards, buff them early and just rush your opponent down. But unfortunately there are just some better decks that rush you um, than this one at the moment. One card that was really hard to leave out of the deck is Immortal Prelate because of course that goes in really well in a buff deck because when you buff it, it goes in your deck and then comes back out again and retains those buffs. So that is a really good card that would go into the deck. But because I wanted to try with dragons, I decided to leave it out um, because you do need to have a, a quite a high number of dragons. Otherwise, you won't have one in your hand for the synergies to work. So that was a card that I had to cut um, and a prelate works so well with call to arms and I didn't want to play call to arms in this deck because of course these two two drops don't really want to come out of call to arms so that was why I left it out but if I'm being honest guys if you wanted to play a quest paladin deck I think it would be much better to go down the mech route probably play some eggs and also put a mortal prelate in there take out the dragons and I think the deck would probably perform better that being said, it was really cool to try out a Dragon Paladin deck. I have never actually played a deck with dragons in it with Paladin before, so it's pretty cool to try. I did do okay with it, but like I said, it's, it's pretty much an average deck. But I hope you enjoy the games. I certainly had fun with it. Thank you for watching, guys, and I'll see you in the next video. Hunter, okay. Be a dragon. Oh, we really want a dragon now. I've seen more beast hunters than I do like spell hunters recently. Oh, nice, we got it. I see a vision in the place. Now, this is always quite difficult because this helps with my quest, but this is something that. I don't have in my deck any kind of, it's not a removal on itself, but it kind of is. Let's take that. What is this guy playing? It's not a beast, so... <laughs> what? It's quite a good card, that, to be fair. It just hasn't really found a good deck yet. Your weakness. Oh, I see. They're beasts themselves. All right. Well, I think I give the torn. I'm not, I can't kill all the beasts, so I may as well kill none of them. I think that's best. I suppose it gives you a really good target to Crackling Razormore. My shield for Argus. Okay. No, not Hunter's Mark. No. Ah, oh, that's so bad. Tarim's really bad, actually. All right, well we're not in a bad position. I think I just scale bane here. Hopefully it's still on the board to do Sound the Bells on. 
Your weakness. I thought we'd already seen the best death rattle hunters. I think Banana Dude's good because it gives me another minion on board. That egg was, was awesome for him. It was really scarabag. He's managed to get, what, eight one ones out of it? Because the second one only got, the third one only got two. I really need something like Spike Ridge Steed to shore me up because that Hunter's Mark kind of ruined me a bit. So hopefully make it a bit easier to play Tarion as well. Ah, oh, we got the steed, but we didn't get any minions. Well, next time I can do that. Um, I could put one sound the bells on. That's actually not that bad if I put one. Because I've got the steed, which complete the quest for me. If I put one on here, it means he has to trade two minions in Primitive. with the full health. Oh, another one. Okay. Oh, that's awesome. Back up eight health. So he's probably got a cube or play dead in his hand. Otherwise, these two aren't that great. My pack will hunt you down. Uh, okay. Um, draw a dragon. Come on. Cool. Let's do this first. I don't want to want. That is excellent here. The it's going to take a good turn for him to get out of this. Oh no! Not down. Oh come on, man. Come on, man, that's not fun. That's no fair. All right, let's just put a couple of minions down. So if he gets play dead to be able to hit there, play dead. Maybe it'll hit one of these guys. The battle. My poor Galvadon. He's only got three cards. Sucks. I right, draw a dragon, please, so I can crowd race through him. Please get a dragon. Yes. Crowd race is not that great, though, to be fair, because it gets rid of these two as well, which means that these two will definitely clear. Ah, oh, I can do nine more in his face, though. No, I really want to do. I really want to do nine in his face. He's only got one card left. It sucks because those two are gonna definitely kill this. I mean, then I might get lucky and it hits these two, but I doubt it. But at ten health, I've always got true silver. Um, or Uther, we can get rid of him. As long as he hasn't got a play dead, that would be awful. 
I feel like you would have played it last turn on the on that one at least. Did he just top deck that? Oh. Go on, hit the T6. Hit the T6. T4 even. What? Oh, this guy's draws, man. Oh, okay, that's fine. <laughs> as long as he doesn't get a taunt, we're good. That is actually a really nice top deck. That means that 9 to the face I did was really important earlier. I quite like his deck though, he's uh, going for something different and I actually really think this is... I actually think this um, Scarab egg worked quite well for him. Priest. I think Priest is a really bad matchup for me. It's not Quest Priest, it's probably going to be something like Mind Blast Priest. I'll just play this. Maybe he's playing Dragons as well. Everyone, everyone always looks at this card like, what's that? Yeah, I think it's going to be Mind Blast Priest, which is a bit annoying. Come on, stop throwing these big cards. <laughs> Oh, okay, so this might be the Xerix Cloning Gallery one, actually. Reporting for duty. <laughs> yeah, I was worried about Spirit Life. Ah, these draws. I think I just tempo play Zilliax. I would never usually do that, but because of this hand, it's. Um, I think it's a good play. That's not the best mass hysterian. Ah, there's our dragon. Um, but let's do this. Let's give him something big to deal with. Then we play Witch Doctor next turn, and if we get a spell, we might actually be able to um, complete the quest. What's he going to play for? Oh, Anduin. The light has betrayed me. Oh, that's annoying. <laughs> Blessing of Kings is pretty good. I don't need it to complete the quest though, because I've got one. The card draw might be really good actually. Try and speed the game up a bit. That is exactly what I need. I can't imagine he hasn't got a Psychic Scream, but it's worth a try. Has he already got Wind Fury? No. Please no Psychic Scream. He's already played Anduin, of course, so that's... We'll make it get rid of it. But if he doesn't kill it, I can... Oh, I'll have Lethal next turn with Uther, most likely. Mass Hysteria won't be enough. 
Okay. Yeah, because you can't target it. Oh, of course. Uncanny. That is really annoying, actually. Alright. Oh, that's annoying. So what's his healing like? His healing is... Oh my god. Alright, I'm going to have to tear him that. I really wanted to hit him in the face, but... So now he's going to psychic screen. Oh, nice! Your victory proves nothing. Right, do we keep the dragon? Against Rogue, I think no. Because if it's odd Rogue, I desperately need some lower cost minions. <laughs> we got Drake anyway. <laughs> okay. No, oh, that is odd, Rogue. Oh my god. I think I'm just going to get beaten to death here. Oh, we got the Cathedral Gargoyle. That's nice. Um, he just hits it with his weapon and kills that, but, you know. Absorbs four damage, at least. Take that. The best two drop in the game. Kind of. Apart from Kelleset. Oh, cool, that's a good draw. I see a vision in the place. So, but no, we'll take the bells. It might be really important. Halt! Who goes there? No idea. Oh. I got another witch doctor. I see a vision in the place. So next turn he's going to weapon and kill that. So the three damage isn't actually that useful. I'm considering you putting Blessing of Wisdom on it, on his minion. Before the quest. Yeah, it's a bit annoying. But I think that's the right play. Because if I manage to draw into cards like... Um, spike with speed, we've got a chance. Tarim's good. Reporting for duty. Job's done. I'm amazing. It is amazing. Hello. Hello. Oh no! <laughs> yeah, we haven't got a chance here. I mean, Taran's gonna be alright if we're still alive. He's something good. He's something good. True Silver, good. Alright. I think we're still pretty much dead, but. Taran might actually be pretty good as long as he doesn't play anything small here. The light protects mm. me. Mushroom oh god. Power! God. Sound the bells! <laughs> We've got three sound the bells now. Uh, yeah, it's got to be Tarim. Unfortunately, he's just going to fast by and slay me and then... Um... No, I think I want to kill that. So I want to Tarim and then kill that. I take one more damage by doing so, but... Otherwise, his, his henchman thug's not going to die to Tarim. I don't think we're going to stick in this game very long. No! <laughs> Happy feast of winter mail. Yay! 
yeah, it wasn't quite so good against the Odd Rig. This is quite nice. We've got the dr Dragon Synergy and the Buff Synergy. Couple of good two drops into a three. I feel like this guy must be playing Battlecry Rogue, right? With the shark. Cold blood. Well, got a good answer to that. Unless he's got SI7 agent, although he shouldn't be able to activate the SI. Please don't kill it, I'll be so annoyed. Ah, SI. No, this right. What? Ha, this guy's toast. This is so demoralizing. He's got another one to, to contend with. Backstab. All right, that's not bad. Prophecy. Uh, I'm not going to make it to either. A Zeliax would be pretty nice, but uh, I think we're probably a bit screwed here. He knows. He knows. Even though I had a really strong start with like two Cathedral Gargoyles. Oh my god. That's a misplay, right? I'm probably still dead. Ooh. If we survive this turn, I've got a steed. But then he's probably got hasn't played a vast spine yet. Now he's gonna vast spine. No, okay. <laughs> Come on! So close. Eviscerate kills me, obviously, um, but he played one. That's been there since turn two, I think. Really? I think I just draw a card and do Scalebane. How many? Kings. Why wouldn't he play a card there? Then one must be Leroy, maybe. Oh, he's got a fast fine. He's just waiting for it. Yeah, it might be Leroy. Come on, get Ven Lanessa. I think I want to go with plus four plus four here. It's like, at what point do I go face? But I'm playing Uther the next turn, so that's going to be really nice. Cold blood doesn't really matter. Let's just go face. He's already played one. N please don't draw it this way. Because we just have to survive this turn. Didn't play anything. 
I think he concedes now. Oh. <laughs> I didn't even get to play Galvador. 